how to fix the press any key to shut down error in fast boot mode on Xiaomi Redmi or Poco devices without having to use a USB hub or a USB 2.0 port. Hey peeps, what's up? Panchi here, back with another video and I have seen a lot of comments about people encountering the issue wherein they connect their Xiaomi Redmi or Poco device in fast boot mode to your computer. As soon as you type in fast boot devices, you get the error of press any key to shut down. Now, a normal fix or a common fix for that which you will hear over the internet is to use another computer, another USB cable or use a USB 2.0 port and in case you do not have a USB 2.0 port, you are advised to buy a USB hub. However, we do have a fix wherein you do not require this USB 2.0 port or USB hub. So the link to this file is in the description of this video. Now this is a zip file and once you have downloaded it on your computer, all you need to do is say right click on the file make sure it is highlighted and selected and then we are going to say extract all on the next screen you can choose the path wherein you want it to be extracted i will just leave it as it is and say extract once the process has finished successfully you will notice i have this folder over here if i go inside this folder i have another folder called mac os x you can ignore that but this here is the file which we are looking at this is the important file so all you need to do is select the file by clicking on it make sure it is highlighted and selected right click on it and say run as administrator that is it that's all you need to do once you select run as administrator you might get a pop-up screen which says do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device and if you have a password for your admin account you might have to enter that password we are going to select yes on this screen and that's it we have now gotten the message of the operation completed successfully three times and press any key to continue and we can press any key to continue and at this point all you need to do is reboot your device once boot into your operating system boot into fast boot mode connect it run fast boot devices and you should be good to go now those of you who have issues with drivers video on how to install drivers for fast boot on your windows computer is linked in the description of the video another thing i would like to mention is that you can actually verify that what the file is supposed to do it did that so how do you do that right click on the file and in my case i am running windows 11 so i will say show more options here and i will say edit if you get this screen directly just edit the file and all this file is doing is adding some flags to your registry so highlight this part which you see on your screen right now without the double quotes so starting from h key we can highlight this specific path and then we are going to copy it so i will press ctrl c on my keyboard then you go to this search section and here and you can type in r e g e and as soon as you do that you will get the registry editor open the registry editor on the next screen if it asks you again do you want this app to allow make changes to your system say yes it might ask for your admin password and all those things now go to the address bar highlight everything right and then you can delete it and then do a control v and this is going to paste the path which we have just selected and all these three values should have been created and that is it that is the easiest and the fastest way of fixing your press any key to shut down error in fast boot mode on your xiaomi redmi poco devices without having to get a usb hub or a usb 2.0 port and that will do it for this video Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.